Our Mean Streets series continues today with a look at traffic on Interstate 91, a major north-south transportation corridor for the state. Now let's turn to our big monitor to illustrate the specific stretch of road we are talking about. We're talking about 91 starting at the viaduct all the way through downtown Springfield to the Connecticut border. It's an area where traffic gets very congested, and I spoke to state transportation officials to see if there are any plans to alleviate it. I-91. It's almost impossible to avoid if you live or work in the area and are heading to Springfield or Connecticut. And it's known for being congested. Yes, I see uh, later in the day, like around dinner time, 91 South is all jammed up from Springfield right down to the Connecticut line, it looks like. I wouldn't go on the, the highway at that time of day. Northbound seems to be pretty good, but southbound's a mess. Car ownership is up, and that means traffic is up too. A recent study showed that traffic on 91 from the Springfield City line to Longmeadow is up over 8%. In 2011, the Mass Department of Transportation installed 33 cameras along 91 and portions of 291. These devices connect to traffic operations centers. This real-time traffic information is meant to increase safety and reduce congestion. But traffic persists and people avoid taking 91 at all costs. And if I have to do something, I take back roads because um, it gets bad and you're just going to be sitting there for so long <laughs> and no one wants to sit there if they have somewhere to go. So I definitely try to take back roads for sure. I spoke to MassDOT about plans to improve 91 and they said right now there is only bridge repair work on the viaduct and a resurfacing project, both in preliminary design phases. There are no major plans for improvements on this busy stretch of roadway. And according to the state, traffic volume peaks on 91 during some of the most popular travel times from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. and from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m.